Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. A very warm welcome if you are new. My name is Nikki and this is a new Sims 4 cast series where I create high school cliques starting with the Mean Girls. As lockdown is easing up and I'll be going back to my full time job on a more regular basis, I thought it would be cool but also a lot of fun to make quick enjoyable cast videos creating recognisable high school cliques that are quite prevalent in movies and TV. The sims I create for this series aren't based on any existing characters, they're purely from my imagination which I thought would be more fun and I'll be creating only one outfit per sim to keep the videos more short and refined. All the sims I create for this series will be teens, which is why they have only two traits instead of three, and the traits I chose helped to guide me in having a better idea of who they are and what they looked like. The first sim in this video is Carly Green and her traits are self-assured and mean. And I promise I didn't make that rhyme on purpose. I thought having a stereotypical pretty blonde haired blue eyed teenage girl fit perfectly into this group but I also wanted to give her a slight air of manipulative innocence perhaps with the socks and Mary Jane shoes. I absolutely love her Chanel hat, it definitely sends the message that she is from a wealthy background and she is proud to show off that fact. With the teen girls in this video I wanted to keep it a bit lighter when it came to their makeup. So each girl is wearing either eyeliner or eyeshadow, not both. I'll probably leave that for the gothic group. And I wanted to keep their accessories and jewellery fairly simple. They are not necessarily extravagant attention seekers, but they do want to be noticed and I think they each have enough to make that happen. Out of these three girls, I would definitely say that Carly is the most manipulative and she gets away with a lot more than she really should. The next mean girl is Amelia Hampton and her traits are insider and snob. I wanted her to look like she would be a fun girl to know but she would definitely judge how you look and how popular you are before considering being friends with you. As she has the insider trait, she would be the leader of the pack and be the first to know about the coolest parties and the juiciest gossip. If she doesn't know about it, it's not worth knowing. She may also be one to start a rumour or two, especially if you cross her, so you'd be careful not to get on the wrong side of her. I am hoping to break up this series with other cast episodes, tiny makeovers, more occult sims but I really am excited about this series as it is a theme that I think many people can identify with even if not personally but certainly through the media that we consume. Speaking of breaking up videos, I am planning to bring out the third episode of my Legacy Challenge Let's Play Wednesday coming. Unfortunately, my computer is playing up, so it is taking me a lot longer than usual to edit, but hopefully I can get it all done and uploaded for you to watch on Wednesday. I'm really excited about this series, it's fun to record and I really hope you enjoy watching it. I really love this hair that I've given Amelia and I know I've said it before, I'm becoming a broken record but I really am so happy about transitioning to Maxis Match hair. I am a fickle person so who knows, maybe in six months time I'd go back to alpha hair. I really don't think so because the custom content Maxis Match hairs that people create are so beautiful and especially when it comes to afro textured hair, Maxis Match afro textured hair is stunning to me. If you have any favourite Maxis Match custom content creators, especially for hairs, feel free to put them down in the box below, I would love to check them out. The final mean girl we have in this video is Crystal Simpson and her traits are self-absorbed and materialistic. If there's anyone who desires to be well known, famous, a bit of a celebrity, especially for not doing much, think 
reality TV star, no hate, that's just how it is today, then that would be Crystal. And I certainly wouldn't be surprised that she's chosen to be friends with Emilia because of her people connections and Carly because of her wealth connections. All of these girls are probably frenemies so they are in this friendship because of what they can do for each other as well as anything else. There's something about Crystal that makes me think that she would make it the most obvious if she doesn't like you, whereas the other two would smile in your face and talk about you behind your back. If Crystal doesn't like you, you will know it. She also cares a lot about being well known on social media, having lots of followers, having lots of people give her compliments. You are only useful to her if you can tell her how great she is or if you can help her progress in her dreams. Let me know in the comments below if you have a favourite, if you identify with any of these sims or if you know anyone like these sims. Funny enough, I actually like all three of these girls, I just have an attachment to the sims that I create. Don't forget in the description box below you will find links to the custom content that I've used as well as links to my social media like Twitter and Instagram. If you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, have a beautiful day, stay safe and I hope to see you next time. Bye everyone!